Well, temperatures as you head farther east, remaining a bit on the cool side, but as you head farther west, we are starting to warm up a little bit. Uh, we do expect to see some snow out near the Black Hills of South Dakota. In fact, winter storm watches have been posted there, and then heading into next week, we are getting indications of some cooler temperatures, again, below average. Keep in mind that your averages are starting to go up, so when we talk about uh, cooler than average temperatures, it's not going to be significantly colder, but yesterday we had some snowfall from Marquette to Chicago, over to Indianapolis and Cleveland, at least a couple of inches in a few spots. Temperatures were also a bit on the cool side with some 30s and 40s. Rapid City, though, up to 60, 13 degrees above average. Elsewhere, though, anywhere from 10 to almost 15 degrees uh, below average, though, we still are melting some snowfall. Now two inches of snow on the ground in the Twin Cities. And there's your winter storm watches out near the Black Hills of South Dakota, even into far northwestern Nebraska. Maybe some four to six plus inch snowfall tallies as we take into Thursday night and Friday. So there's the trough, a little pressure still swinging in some snow across parts of the Great Lakes region. Pretty quiet, though, in the middle Mississippi Valley. A little bit breezy. Uh, we are going to be warming up, though, as you head farther south to the west today. And then as the storm system begins to move out into the plains. We've got that snow that'll be developing again. Maybe some four to six plus inch snowfall tallies there. Still some snow across the Great Lakes lingering and then the rain will actually be pushing into the central part of the country there as well. But milder as you head south and west here today.